So why are f-stops backwards? Why is it that an f2.8 is a wide aperture and an f16 is a smaller aperture? Did you ever wonder that? <laughs> Welcome to the channel, my name is Charles Wallers, this is Waller Photography, and today we're talking about apertures. Why are they backwards? They're not. They're not backwards. These are fractions. You get F slash 2.8, F slash 5, F slash 16. They're fractions. The F is your focal length. See, when you got different size lenses, different lengths, 500 millimeter, 200 millimeter, 50 millimeter, or 18 millimeter, light is going to travel a lot different through the lenses. The focal length and that aperture, that f5, is not the same on this lens as it is on this lens. So just to keep it simple, I'm going to show you a 100 millimeter and then the 50 millimeter. Uh, like I said, this is focal length divided by the aperture, by your f number, focal length divided by number. So if I'm here at 100 millimeter divided by 5, f5, that gives me an opening on the aperture of 20 millimeters. 100 divided by 5 is 20. 20 millimeter opening is what this lens needs to be the same amount of light coming through this one at f5, which is a 10 millimeter opening. 50 divided by 5, 10 millimeter. 100 divided by 5, 20 millimeter. That's the size of the opening these lenses need so that the same amount of light hits the sensor. When we're measuring light, nothing else. This is why it's so complicated when we're talking about focal distances and mathematical formulas. It's not a secret, the numbers are not backwards. F2.8 is a much larger fraction than F16. F16 is one divided by 16 is gonna be many decimals where one divided by one is gonna be one. So you can see how the numbers are not backwards. They're just really confusing if you don't understand the mathematical formula. I hope I was able to explain the difference in this video. If you didn't get it, let me know in the comments and maybe I can help you out a little more. But the numbers are not backwards, they're just fractions. Now that you know it's focal length divided by the aperture, that's the size of the opening your, your lens is going to need so that the sensor has the same amount of light. These are variables, light is the same. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video.